Hey, hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. Let's have ourselves a tiny battle to start off this part because we pretty much used all the character designs. To... By the way, if, I, if you didn't get the um, idea of it, the characters, you know, they, these different kinds of Bomberman designs here, they have absolutely no effect on the gameplay whatsoever. They're just a little aesthetic change of sorts. This is the high-powered area, isn't it? Yes, it is! <laughs> The volcano area is quite fitting for such a battle, I have to say. Alright, me and black versus green. Gotta... Oh, well, actually that worked out, so whatever. <laughs> if battles go that fast, this is gonna be another one of those stages that I'm gonna have to do two playthroughs on. <laughs> oh... I'm gonna... Oh, you know what? I'll, I'll see if I can divide and... Uh-oh. Divide and conquer if at all possible, and that did not work. There is no chance of getting out of that. Well, I suppose I could have tried kicking my way out, but... Or I can just hope for a draw. That works, too. <laughs> Poor tiny spinning bombers. I'm so sorry. But don't worry, we have more battles to come. More full-powered battles of epicness. Oh, dear. Oh, jeez. How high... Wow. <laughs> I was gonna say, how high is the bomb blast radius? But it's pretty dang high, I have to say. Oh, no. No. It's a... too epic for words. One win apiece. Okay, this is not epic. <laughs> oh, jeez. It's so hard to keep track of so many things at once because you're, because, you know, you got your eyes all the way across the screen trying to keep track of the large bomb blasts crossing, crossing over the areas and yeah, this is going to have to be another one of those two play stages. That went way, way too quick. Match two on ye ol' volcano starts. No need for such a dramatic intro, but it happened anyway. Yeah, that was terrible timing with my bombs there. I should have waited a little longer for that third bomb I placed. Wow. <laughs> that was pretty one-sided. Oh. For once, I was the one that suicided. I I'm shocked. And also a little appalled. <laughs> oh! Another one-sided battle, and that's actually our first loss. We just got blasted at the exact same time, like nothing we could do about it. <laughs> well, I'm, there was probably something we could have done, but... That, it's, it still feels too short, so one more round through this. <laughs> there isn't really all that much more to say about this stage, because of the fact that it's just simply the full power stage of this... of the battle mode here. Whoa! Nelly. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna try and trap him in the corner if I can. No, that's just... Oh, jeez. Not gonna work. Can't trap me because I got the kick. Uh, oh, jeez. Oh, my! <laughs> it's a draw. The, the draws are quite common on super full-powered stages like this in Bomberman games, if you, if you never noticed that. Because both players typically are trying... Well, I should say all four players are trying to corner the other player so it, it turns into a checkmate situation because otherwise they can just continuously escape using the kick or something like that and what happens is that both... Oh, shoot, I jumped the gun there. What happens is that both players... Well, I said both players again. All players end up grouping around the same area just like that and then draws occur. But otherwise, matches tend to be really fast, even if they are, you know, draws. But if we keep having draws, this may actually go on longer than I thought. <laughs> I can't let this happen. I want the parts to be about the same length, if at all possible, for niceness. Is niceness a word? I suppose it is. I'm pretty sure it is, actually. Oh, shoot. Well, actually, that works. Yeah, that works great. <laughs> I didn't mean to trap my buddy there, but... Victory was at hand, so what else could you do? I believe if they would have kicked the bomb downwards, the one that I placed there, it would have got caught up in an explosion and then detonated early, causing a draw. 
so that might have been why they didn't do that, but I'm, I might be giving too much credit to the computers there. Alright, that was the last time I'm playing this stage. And victory goes to the Tiny Bombers, and the loss goes to the Tiny Bombers. Yes, both team name. I mean, both teams have the same names. Alright, next one, we are going to have a battle of old men, just because it's fun like that. <laughs> Alright, there's no real reasoning behind this. No! I once again did it. Soft reset, soft reset. All fixed, man, that was fast. Let's go to the next stage, this super happy... Emotion City here. I have no idea. High speed field. <laughs> oh my. Well, it's clear that being old does not affect your performance. <laughs> yeah, I, I, as I said before, the character design that you choose doesn't do anything in the slightest. Will it matter if someone has a green Louie on the stage in like at all? Because I'm pretty sure we move as fast as the green Louie does anyway, so the green is as good as the pink one in this one, I think. Ah, <laughs> uh, and I got the pink one, of course, just because I said the green was as good as the pink one. So, you know what? Switch. Yellow, much better. <laughs> just as long as I had the opportunity to switch there, I might as well switch, just for the heck of it. And my buddy's also got a pink one. Oh my god. Goodness, that is fast computers. How do they twitch so quickly? <laughs> oh, poopers. <laughs> How wow, they must have had a lot of caffeine. And that was terrible moves on my part. I should have just dashed forward, but I have no idea why I decided to stand there. It's as if I forgot about my ridiculously high speed somehow. <laughs> How do you play like that? <laughs> no one has the reaction time to play like that. That's impossible. You would have to be a computer. <laughs> and they're playing pretty equally. Okay, they are playing exactly equally. <laughs> it's a draw, but that actually works sort of for us because it keeps the stage going rather than it going too quickly like the last one. <laughs> this one has the potential of being another super quick stage, as you can tell by the high speed nature of it. Well, hello, purple one! Yeah! I haven't seen you in ages! And yet the match is over! I didn't even get a chance to use its jumpy awesomeness! And that stage really did go quick, so I'm gonna have to play another two stages of this. <laughs> I just can't leave it like that. I must show more. <laughs> Match two. Here we go. Hopefully it'll go longer this time. Clearly Red Bomber is not cooperating. <laughs> the game is... The game is again turning me into a liar. <laughs> How does this happen? Tell me! <laughs> well, why did the green at the bottom left corner there not do anything for like two seconds? Just move to a corner, you know, to drop and blast as many blocks as you can as fast as you can. This is the high speed stage, man. That's the idea. <laughs> oh, my high speed got the better of me. Actually, it's more like the worst of me, because I went a little bit too far over and got nicked by the explosion. As you notice, I wanted to dodge around the corner. But alas, I couldn't. Well, I could have, but I just held the right on the control pad or D-pad a little bit too long. Green one, which means pretty, pretty much... Wait, switching places even makes you switch Louis? I should say switches your power-ups and stuff like that. Wow, that's... The skull is pretty brutal when it makes you switch like that. <laughs> and I didn't even mean to grab the skull, by the way, if you didn't know that. I just ran into it because of how dang fast I'm going. Yellow Louie! Oh, pff, Jesus. Oh, well, victory. 
All right, that's all I'm playing in this stage. I can't control myself, literally. But it's pretty fun though. <laughs> Woo! All right, next stage we are going Kirby style, just because it's the last stage. Kirby and Snorlax style, I should say. Yep, all chunkiness of awesome sauce. They probably would like some awesome sauce in the final stage is a water stage, which sort of makes the en entire game's water aspect... Well, I suppose not. Well, yeah, it, it kind of does. Um, you'll notice that the bombs stay above the surface of the water so that they can explode, sort of. But the ones that are underwater, like in the undersea ones, are able to explode, you know, despite having fuses that need to be lit. <laughs> I know there's bombs that can go off underwater, but these don't look like the bombs that can do that. <laughs> these are the bombs that you'd see in the Adam West Batman series way, way back in the days. <laughs> and, you know, he, he managed to fuse one of these kinds of bombs by throwing it into the water. Although those Batman days are not canon to Bomberman, of course. So, you know, maybe I'm just spewing baloney as usual. <laughs> oh, well, I lost. Let's do another stage. Well, another run. See, I said stage again. Oh, well, it's too late for, for it. I'm too long gone. I'm probably going to continue to say stage no matter what. <laughs> and what happened to one of the computer? I can't tell. Oh, jeez, it's me versus them two. Two versus one. I don't like those odds. <laughs> I don't know if the computers are good at teaming up, though, so I might have a shot. If I don't, I'm gonna have to do an yet another battle mode double play here because these things are going too fast. <laughs> I don't know why these last three stages in the game are going too fast, but they are! <laughs> well, sort of. Uh, I don't know where there's bombs, but I felt a bomb. <laughs> oh my, I am too frightened for words. I guess frightened is a good word to say it, to describe it, I mean. <laughs> so I guess I did have words to describe it. Oh, what can I do about them? They are too good for me. Although they're playing pretty much as one character. They rarely split up. <laughs> okay, now they're split up. Again, the game made me a liar, as usual. And I really have to be careful of what's underneath the ivy. Because I don't know when they're plopping a bomb. I know there's a bomb around the corner! <laughs> I just seen it pulsing underneath the, the, the vines there, and it's like, oh my. Oh, this is too stressful for my own good. Need some sort of stress relief to relax. I should be playing video games. Wait, I am playing video games. Curses! My plans have been foiled. Oh, it's a draw! <laughs> All that work and it turns into a draw. That was a pretty good stalemate, though. Neither of us could, like, back each other into a corner, but at the same time, we couldn't, you know, blast each other in the middle of things either. So that turned out pretty awesome. <laughs> and my partner killed himself. Again. How is this possible? It's gonna be me versus green and red again. You know what? Can I trap? No, I can't. It's too late. The field is too wide open. Oh, I could have trapped green there. Maybe. Unless it had the kick. I don't think it had the kick, though. I'll try and grab that kick, though. Eh. Oh, it did have a kick, and I don't have a kick. Because it got the secondary kick that was over there. How many times did I say kick there? I am unsure. But it certainly was fitting for the situation. <laughs> Oh, even the red one has got the kick. Really? Really? I am completely outmatched here. <laughs> the only thing that could make this worse is if they both had purple Louis or something like that. <laughs> I'm on top of a bomb, I know I am. Uh, oh, I wasn't sure how I could have escaped that one. No, I failed. I still feel that went a little bit fast, so I'm gonna do one more round, I suppose. 
on this last stage. I mean, it is the final part anyway, so we'll make this a special double and triple feature of all the remaining battle stages, I suppose you could call them. <laughs> and what kind of area are we battling in anyway? It's like some underground, underwater ruins of sorts. But this was not in the game whatsoever. Then again, that last stage, you know, the high speed zone we played wasn't in the game either. It's like, where does this take place? It's, it's the world's greatest mystery at this point. Okay, maybe it's not that big of a mystery. Oh, I almost trapped the green, dang it. I seen the opportunity, but I just acted on it a little bit too late. That is too bad. Ah, uh, must defend home turf. Which is now everything. <laughs> oh jeez. Oh my. No! Now it's black versus the computers. We are doing terrible this match. Probably because it's the final match, but still. <laughs> Come on, black. You can do it. You can do it. I have faith in you. I think this is going to be another stalemate by the looks of things. Wait, where's Black? I don't... Oh, okay. I, th I thought he got trapped in there somehow. Like, maybe there's a bomb uh, that trapped him in a three-square area over there. Like, up north of him? You probably know what I'm talking about. Because you know how bomber bomber men get trapped in battle games. I don't need to over-describe things here. <laughs> Whoa! Is that another draw? Yep. Didn't expect that, but okay. A draw is still not a victory for the opponent. It's not a victory for us either. Aww. And Red just committed suicide. So did Black. <laughs> Jeez, people, what's wrong with you? Don't you know to stay away from your own bombs? You should go to, like, demolition school or something like that. <laughs> I'm gonna try and grab items. Oh jeez, got the kick. Why did you grab that? Probably to prevent yourself from getting trapped. But I need you to get trapped, otherwise I won't be able to win. Eh. Oh, I can't kill him. I have little faith in myself now. <laughs> so many draw games. And I forgot how large my explosion radius was. <laughs> I really should pay more attention to my blasts. And, and not in a suicide way, I mean... Red just killed himself again. <laughs> what I'm talking about is, you know, the radius of them. Not, not like suiciding by trapping myself in a corner or something like that. And... What happened? <laughs> well, we won, that's what happened. <laughs> this could very well be the last match of the walkthrough and the end of the walkthrough. That would be kind of sad, I've had so much fun with Mega Bomber Man. Although I should probably rush over to the green and see if I can put pressure on him. Eh. Can I put pressure on him? I don't know. I'd like to at least keep him trapped in that area. Or I can't... Dang it! It's too wide now! Curses! I should say that the area is too mobile. I just thought I would do a little early game rush if I could, but nope, not gonna happen. I figured if I, you know, could suicide and get him at, at the same time while leaving Black Bomber unscathed, that would still be a victory for us. But alas, it just didn't happen. But, but Black Bomber did exactly what I wanted to do earlier. <laughs> so, that is another victory for us. And the end of the walkthrough. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next walkthrough. Woo! Do the sumo! Better yet, Come on, every pony, smile, smile, smile. <laughs> okay, okay, I won't do that. Toodaloo!